There's nothing like chilling with my girls. Just me and my divas taking over the world. What's up, divas? What's up, divas? What's up, everyone? What's up, y'all? What's up? What's up? Today's video is going to be super quick. I always say that it's not going to be super quick. It's not. It's not. I'm lying because I will time lapse it, and that's the only way that's going to happen. But today's video is going to be fun, like it always is. Okay, Once you guys already noticed the lace front wig video. It's cheap. You know what I'm saying? It's 22 inches. It's 168 dollars. They got a bunch of coupon codes, so it could be cheaper than that with these all these codes off. But it's by Euler Hair. Okay. Now listen, I'm not really sure if that's how you pronounce it. It might be Euler or Euler or I'm not really sure. But for today's video, it's going to be called You Lair Hair. So they sent me this 22 inch Virgin Brazilian loose wig, 13 by 6 inch frontal lace front wig. This is the best hair around, like, meaning it's like maintenance free. You don't have to do anything. Like, meaning because it's loose wave, you don't have to do nothing. You ain't got to stand there with the curling iron for like hours trying to curl it up. You know, you don't have to do nothing. You could just spritz some of this on it, put a little conditioner up in that water and spritz it and let it curl up and then run out the door and be cute for the entire day. That's how easy it is. There are some steps that you might want to take prior to just being cute. You might want to bleach the knots, which I did. And you might want to pre-pluck the hairline, which I did. And you might want to put an elastic band in it, which I also did that it did come with. And make sure that them hooks are hooked in the back, which they ain't. But make sure you snap those combs down because there are four of them total, three in the front and one in the back. Okay, said, I did all of that work, so it worked out in my favor. I hung it up, I let it dry like this, you know, in the tub, over the tub, whatever. I let it air dry. So, this is air dry hair, okay. And when you hang it upside down like this on some type of hanger or something, girl, your, your curls will come out like bedazzled. I don't even know how to say that, but your girls will come out really nice. Um, as so, for the hairline on it, like I said, I had to work with it, pre-pluck it. I'm trying to remember, was it bad or not? It was very dense at the hairline. Um, when I did receive this, the hairline was really thick, and I did record art and take a few pictures of it, so I will make sure to insert it in the video. Um, the, the hairline was really thick. It was It was very thick. Okay, so it didn't take me any time at all to pre-pluck it. You know, I did bleach it prior to that, so that definitely helped. But you will have to pre-pluck this wig. So this one ran for $168 for 22 inches, 150% density. So you know that's pretty cheap for this wig. Plus there's like major coupon codes on it. So it'll go cheaper than what the price is already as is. It'll get cheaper. So just keep in mind with this particular unit, you will definitely have to customize it. Because if you don't, honey. Trust me when I tell you, you will walk around looking like heady monster. I be telling y'all, some of these wigs, girl, mm, you have to really work with them. But we're gonna work with this one right now. We're gonna see how this go. Pray for a sister. Just pray for a sister. All right, ladies. So you guys seen how much I had to take out of that hairline? It was really thick. Um, and it does say it's pre-plucked, but I'm not really sure where, but I pre-plucked it. So it is pre-plucked now. I'm just gonna take my hair clips and I'm going to make sure that the wig fits properly. Sometimes the wigs will fall over your earlobes, so you want to make sure that they're right above them because the caps are standard size. Some caps are bigger than others, I've noticed a lot. But, you know, that work out in other people's favors, depending on your head size. So I just take a part, a comb, and I just part it right above my ear like so.
and I take my scissors, small pair of scissors, and then I just cut right where that part is at. So that way the wig will fit properly to me. It won't be like overlapping. I won't have to tuck it behind my ear. It'll just lay really, really flat. And then when it's time, I'll cut the lace off of the front of the wig. You know, you must do that. But yeah, I'll just cut the front off. I don't really cut the hairs, or excuse me, I don't really cut the lace too close because I don't want any of the hairs to fall out. But that's what I do. And sometimes I cut really close. I don't know you know so now we're gonna go ahead and make some sideburn hairs now this is just an optional step you guys know all of the, the steps that I take um but yeah I'm just gonna make them a little bit thinner this time because the hairline was rather thick and I really don't like a lot of sideburn hairs or baby hairs especially with curly hair because curly hair is like really easy to camouflage or you know what I'm saying hide the lace because the hair will curl up on the end so you don't really need a lot but for some reason I don't know why I put a lot in this particular video but you know I hey it is what it is so I'm gonna take my favorite glam gel which is by got to be okay and this stuff works good like it holds it down I don't really use a lot of this sometimes I'll use it on a sideburn sometimes I'll just use regular hairspray but I love this stuff I also like the matching hairspray to it you can check Ulta.com out for it they have it and you can also buy it in stores the shipping from Ulta is really quick and cheap so I buy like cans at a time now once you've gone, went ahead and situated your sideburn hairs, you know what I'm saying, you can go ahead and make your wispy hairs or your baby hairs or whatever you want to call them. This is optional, but sometimes you must have, you must do it because sometimes the lace is not that great to where you can, you know, where it can melt in your skin. You know, sometimes you can see the lace. So sometimes you might need to camouflage the edges of the lace. So that's the reason why I'm going to do the baby hairs on this particular unit. I really don't like to do them as much. Sometimes I like to do them sparingly, but you know, hey. So I did take that got to be hairspray and I sprayed it behind the baby hairs, behind the wispy hairs, onto the, 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 onto the lace directly is what I did. Um, you can also spray it underneath. Sometimes I spray it underneath, sometimes I don't. But anyway, I did notice that there were some visible knots still in you in the unit after I bleached it. And I hate when that happens. You don't you don't see them. Sometimes some of them won't bleach because it's not enough. But you can always easily clear that up with some makeup or concealer. So, you know, hey. We're just gonna get into styling this. I did put a little bit of hairspray on the wig and blow dried it, so that's the reason why I was basically combing out. But for the most part, you know, I wasn't like a huge fan of the hairline at all, but I like the texture of the hair. Like the texture of the hair is great. It's $168. You can get it for $160 or $169, but you can get it for $160 with the coupon code on their website. But it all depends on the length of hair you choose and also the density so this is 150 density and it's 22 inches so that's the reason why it's 169 but if you like it shorter and you like 130 percent density then of course it's going to be cheaper um i think for 130 percent with curly hair it definitely will work so if you want to get a little bit lower in price then i would go with the 130 density so I'm not just going to sculpt these hairs into my skin or my lace front, you know. And that's about it. You guys already know the rest of the... You already know the rest. So enjoy the rest of the video, guys. The hairline was not that great. Like, I'm not over-exaggerating, okay? I'm not, like, saying, uh -huh. it wasn't that great. You have to pre-pluck it. You have to customize it. But it was worth it. I think I did, like, a really good job. Make sure you put some bleach on this. I used 30 Developer and the BW2 
or B2W. I don't know. It's BW2 or B2W. Either way, you know what I'm talking about. And I used the 30 developer by Salon Pro and left it on for like 45 to 50 minutes. So it came out really good. You know, look, it looks like it's growing out of the scalp, bitch, honey. Mm -hmm. There are like a few little bit of speckles that I can see. But you have to be like super duper close. Like, so if you have like a bigger head, like an average or like above, I don't know what you want me to call it, okay? But if your head is like a little bit, you know, like a little bit big, okay? Like it could be from your hair, like if you have like too much hair, you know, or you just like really, really smart, something like that. So don't take offense. But if you have like, you know, your chromium or whatever you want to call your dome piece, your dome is a little bit bigger than like, like mine, okay? That could just mean like you're smarter than me. But if, if it is, this will fit you. Like you'll have some room in it because it's nice. It's stretchy. I have the hooks close together and it still gives you room right here. Plus you'll have a little bit of extra to cut off if, you, if your head is small, like on a smaller on, like side. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You got it. You know, it'll fit. But... Make sure you get you some tweezers, girl, because you're going to need those for the hairline. So, like, it was dumb and easy to put on. Like, the, let me tell you, when I first saw the hairline on this wig, I was like, oh, my God, I'm going to be here for, like, an hour or, or more. But you know what? To my surprise, I wasn't. You guys, let me know what you think about you layer or you layer hair. But they got, like, a whole bunch of coupon codes. Y'all know how I feel about this curly hair, girl. Oh, it's so cute. I love me some curly hair. This looks like another wig that I have. Listen, I'm telling you guys, they start looking the same after a while. For real, the only thing different is the lace and the hairlines. But you can get this for $160 because it's a $9 promo code on there for you. We'll have to customize it to your liking. It's 150% density deep wave hair so it's deep wave it said pre-plugged so i listen it is pre-plugged now but let me know what you think of this unit i got to go got so much to be i love you guys stay diva and delicious and i'll see you guys on a soon to come video